how to adjust this. So I am driving right now and um, I actually wanted to start doing videos that are kind of like outside of my little, you know, comfort zone of my house, you know, with the same backdrop all the time. Uh, so today, I y'all, I have been up since three this morning. Uh, so I'm I'm going on pretty close to twenty hours uh, as of now. So um, so I okay. So originally, I wanted to uh, talk about something that kind of uh, dropped in my in my spirit. Um, about the use of your words. So lately, I've been noticing like my um, my words are changing. My 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 speech is changing. And for those of you that know me, you know I love I love to write um, love to write poems. I love to write letters. Whatever it doesn't matter if it involves pen, paper, and words. Like I'm down for it. And um, I, as far as writing goes, I, I can be very eloquent, but when it comes to speaking, that was something that I had to train myself to do, and I'm still not as good as I want to be with it. Uh, sometimes I kind of feel like uh, Moses, like in the scriptures, when the Most High called him to go talk to Pharaoh, and his first you know, complaint was, I'm not good with my speech. That's how I feel. Um, and I, I literally had to train myself. Like, I went to Toastmasters and, you know, just tried a bunch of, of different things to improve the way that I speak and to also improve my vocabulary. And um, I ended up... Um, I, I I think I did a pretty good job, you know, as far as like changing my speech and elevating my speech. I will say it like that. And I started to think about where I've come from, um, where I've come from and, you know, where I'm kind of headed with my speech. And I noticed that a lot of times the words that I use are so different like they are so um they can be out there sometimes um especially when I get goofy when I get really goofy I will start using like all of these enhanced vocabulary words to get my point across and you know some people think it's like funny you know and some people you know it kind of catch them off guard like you know why are you using all these big words? And I and I never realized that I was doing it up until maybe like, I don't know, maybe like a few months ago. I actually realized what I was doing. And, um, you know, if I'm feeling, I'll also use um, like a better vocabulary when it comes to like, like if I'm feeling really, really, really good, like, you know, if I'm really excited about something or if I feel like I'm really making a uh, progress on a project or something and I'm just like feeling great about it, I will start using um, a better vocabulary for, for lack of a better way of saying it. I will start using like a better vocabulary. And I, the reason that I do that, I never really understood but I know that I enjoy doing it, but I never really understood why. And I think I finally come up with an answer. The reason that I do that, um, it does something to your mind when you start using words that elevate your vocabulary. It, it actually does something to your mind. It's like releasing... I want to say endorphins, but I don't know if that's necessarily what I feel when I, you know, say these words, but it just seems like the right word to say. But it's like it breaks something in your mind and frees you up. It gives you a like a higher sense of per well for me. 
It gives me like a higher sense of purpose. And I feel better just by using different words. Um, For example, instead of saying... um, Instead of saying that something bothered me, I'll say, you know, that was infuriating. Or instead of saying, um, you know, oh, you're so pretty today. You know, I'll be like, oh, queen, you look gorgeous. You know what I'm saying? Like just changing up the words that you say can have a great impact on your mentality. And it's, it's almost immediate for me. Um, it has an impact almost immediately and it's to the point that like I almost have I almost crave that like I have to use larger words you know sometimes to pull me out of the rut that I'm in and if you think about it we hear the same words all day every day the same like dead language everybody is using constantly there is no difference in the words. There is no nothing, no, you know, excitement, no nothing. And for you to be, you you know, you know how it is when you get in a rut physically, when you are in like a, a routine, like a day to day routine, you feel like it's time for a vacation. You feel like it's time to break out. It's time to do something different. It's the exact same thing when it comes to your vocabulary to your language it'll be sometimes that like especially while I'm at work it'll be sometimes that I will start speaking in a different language like you know I I know a few Spanish words and you know I can form a couple of sentences I didn't know it kind of fell there sorry guys um but I'll start like forming a couple of like sentences in Spanish you know what I'm saying like um, if I need somebody's signature on something, I'll just walk up to them and be like, Puedes firmarlo, por favor. And just that will just like release something in my mind. You know, it's like a change. And it's the same effect, like I like I said before. It's the same effect as, you know, you going to work every day, you in the same routine, you doing the same thing over and over and over and you get in this rut and you feel this this heaviness on you just because you're in a rut and you feel the first thing you think is I need a vacation I need a break I need to break out of this routine and you take taking that vacation you veering off to a different path in your day-to-day routine out of your getting out of your day-to-day routine that releases something in you the same thing happens with your words when you break out of that everyday day-to-day same language same words you using try to expand your vocabulary and see what it does to your mind try to you know use words that you might have read in a book or that you might have you know seen you know on a movie you know what i'm saying like the, the use words that are going to expand your vocabulary and see how it frees up your mind um I don't know I just I just feel like you know because I I hear a lot of people saying you know why do you talk like that why do you do that you know every once in a while you know I'll say something that's kind of off the wall I'll even make up words you know what I'm saying I will make up words you gonna know what they mean but I'll make them up you know like I just I do that to release myself of this same mundane language and um I don't know, I just feel like sharing that. You know, I feel like the use of your words is just as powerful as your actions. What you say is just as powerful as what you do. So that same way you have to break out of a physical routine, you're going to have to break out of a mental routine and, you know, sprinkle some sprinkle some new words on there. You know, throw some new words out at some people, you know. Just switch the game up a little bit and see how it helps you. All right, everybody, that's all I got for you. And I hope y'all have a fantabulous day. Like, absolutely fantabulous. See y'all later.